Are the judges ready? Yes, we are. I'll be back in a moment, Betty Moore, just enjoying the garden. Very good, Sir Charles. <laughs> Oh, 
She was worried about you and insisted you leave. You're distressed. For me. Yes, I am. That's in the whole house. You must get away from here. You must save yourself. Last night I was out and I saw a man I could not identify. I began to think of him as the man of mystery. Revenge! I was not dead. I was over humiliated. What? There are layers upon layers of suffering. On, on one hand, there's this man of mystery. Revenge! Whose obvious has come out of the blue. On the other hand, there's Mrs. Barrymore. Giving Mr. Barrymore. My wife was very close to him. The motive to kill him, out of revenge. That doesn't make any sense. <laughs> Stay. Matter of lies! He's obviously mad as a hatter, but as far as I can tell, there's no motive. Barrymore. You must get away from here immediately. Be careful, Sir Henry's besotted with her. She's simply pretending to be the soul of the mistress. She's probably in it for the money. No, Henry, it's not true. You must listen to me. There's something that you don't know about my Barrow. brother. He's. Over him now! Wait a minute! What, what's going on? <laughs> Statement in his orange. He must be. I want you to imagine him without this hat. <laughs> <laughs> without all this hair. Now, who does he remind you of? Good Lord! He looks like Sir Hugh! <laughs> exactly! Statement in his basketball. And there's our motive. By killing Sir Henry, Stapleton stands to inherit everything. Quick! Before he gets away! Mr. Stapleton! Oh, that brute! I'll get the shackles. Do you see what this villain has done to me? Beryl! <laughs> Miss Stapleton! Where is your brother? Well, there's only one place he could have gone. The Lord! Edwin! Edwin!